Uh, well, this property property is an example of, of a property where they're 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 at that cusp of investment where they bought the property, they've been holding on to it. Um, it's been empty for a couple years now, and what we're looking to do with the CIP is just sort of offer those the right amount of incentive to get over the hump. And so what you're seeing in the CIP is just you know that right amount of incentives to get people to invest and to get to put more money into their buildings to actually create vibrancy in the core. So whether they're empty units for some retail spaces or incentives for retail space, but more importantly, there's um, incentives for residential concert, uh, conversion. So the second and third floor of buildings that you see downtown, we want people living in those buildings. And so a lot of incentives are geared towards the residential component and getting people downtown is the key for vibrancy and decor. The more people that live downtown, a lot of the other things like retail will follow. Yeah, I mean, Chatham Street's a perfect example of a decline and, and, and sitting empty for years. And hopefully what the CIP will do is, is will nudge those landlords into doing something with their buildings, especially the ones that are you know that have the second third floor uh, either empty or old office space this is perfect for that conversion time so if you can convert old office space into residential units you're gonna get a lot of incentives you're gonna get cash bonuses you're gonna get tax grants those types of things put you over the hump and make it worth the investment